Life is a winding road No telling where it goes Driving through days and nights Won't stop for traffic lights And I lose So Yeah, uh, let's just do this uh, Hi So I have set up this uh, stand it's gonna act as our table for now to cut down our bows and stuff because we needed something stable and large to hold the pieces of wood and everything we decided to just push them out oh sorry fail sorry <laughs> we decided to just push them out through the window so now we are ready to cut down our pieces and go back inside and install them and then we'll have to cut the other pieces and i think we'll just do all the installations the joining of the pieces in the house instead of out here uh, just to make it easier to move the pieces around uh, and such so back to your sport for now ah also my a lot of my stuff is like yellow it's a sign even if i'm falling down i will keep on searching for my highs you can say i lost my mind i will keep on holding my head high even if the sky is falling down Trusting our wings to fly Sometimes we're crashing down But we get up and start from the ground Keep on searching for my highs You can say I lost my mind I will keep on holding my head high Even if the sky is falling down We are going to repeat the same. We'll repeat the same with this one. So this portion of the video is brought to you by Skillshare. Skillshare is an online learning community with thousands of inspiring classes for anyone who loves learning and wants to explore or expand their creative journey. The class that I'm taking right now is Inclusive UX, uh, Designing Websites for Everyone by Regine Gilbert. So I've decided it's time for me to make sure that my blog is at the same level as I am. Picked up on so much on this class because I want my website to be very user friendly but still make it look very nice and clean and classy but also have it represent everything that I stand for and me as a person in terms of my personality, the things that I like. I want it to really be a true representation of who I am and the journey I am on right now so to make sure that you get to share in the joy of what skillshare has to offer the first 1000 people to use the link in the description box will get a one month free trial of skillshare so head on to the description box and click on that link and choose any class that you would want to try from the thousands and thousands of classes that are available on skillshare now let's go on with the video <music> I'm gonna 
If I do say so myself, so we're going to add two doors to the front over here. So that will be open. This will be open. Two doors in the middle. Umekalia sanda. Makalia eko sanda. Nipatia eko sanda. So we're going to <laughs> recreate this on the other side and then now um, sort out the shelves uh, after we have done the other side and see how we want to style our shelves. Ziggy, are you okay? So we're going to attempt to remove this as one. So here you are. I can take this anymore. You say we want, but you still want more. Baby, what I need is you out the door. And I'm sure. Yeah. That you're a bad boy. Up to no good. Trying to be a man, but you're stuck in boyhood. Baby, you won't ever treat me the way you should. So it's over for good. I will never smile for you, smile for you, smile for you, smile for you. So the corners is many sumbua, they're refusing to budge. So I'm going in with a drill to make them as weak as possible. Just do a bunch of holes and then hammer the hell out of them until they fall off. So yeah. Baby 
This portion of the video is brought to you by Color Creators. As you know, Color Creators is where I go to satisfy my color obsession. And they are our paint partners for this renovation journey that we've decided we are on. And every single type of paint you see me using in this project will be from color creators and ease from color creators so if you're looking for paints for your house if you want to paint your exteriors your interiors if you're looking for um, just the good old everyday kind of paints or if you are looking for the design the glittery the shimmer the pearls of the paints color creators is the spot for you so head on over to color creators to satisfy any and all your paint needs their contacts are linked in the description box and check out their instagram as well let's grow their numbers over there as well go on with the video take a real close look Okay, so I'm going back in with the second coat of the primer, um, especially the base on that side. The top, I'm not going to add a second base because the color that's going there is darker than the base coat that I have right now. But the base, I've added a second coat because the color that's going on that wall is lighter than the color that was there. So that's the whole idea of doing the priming. But I'm just going to uh, do like two, three coats. Um, this is like I've done no this is one coat so I'm gonna do two more coats on this uh, and then leave it there I've done two coats the part that's going to be our vanity apart from that section up there I'm going to go in with a brush instead uh, because there's still a lot of soil so I want to first wait for this to completely dry remove the soil and then go in with a brush and then come back with our final coat and then we can finally switch over but do you see the difference this is just the primer and then that's like that landlord cream okay this one is the cream one as in it is so yellow and not in a good way you know like when you compare battery died uh this is our last battery so we're going to have to conserve this one so anyway my plan is to prime the whole house i'm going to prime all the walls because in doing so i'm going to have a blank canvas not just for me Ooh, i keep seeing birds today like there's a cute bad with a yellow neck thing that's walking down there um anyway yeah i enjoy i enjoy seeing birds. this one that had come all the way to the window earlier sorry basically prepping for the final final look but do you see how when you have like white walls it kind of just changes everything i really like i like i like having clean because they look clean they look neat and also not forgetting the fact that these other walls had like different types of colors like the color that's here is not the same color as on that's like where you guys are standing the wall behind you then that wall has like portions that have this color and it's like a lot yellower than the other one but i feel like even here where we had uh, patched up the walls once we paint everything is going to look very nice and smooth because i just had an epiphany and Yanni, I'm so shocked that I did not think this before. How this did not occur to me before makes no sense. How I didn't even think to try it out, there's a new puppy, before, just doesn't make sense to me. So, you know this ugly thing I have, where our doors are going to go, which is our former... Um, dining room window that's going to become the new door it's been looking so bad and I, I don't like seeing it like every time I post I'm just like ugh and that's been making me think ah, I really need to get these doors made but I really like the doors I want to get are not cheap and I don't want to end up paying um, like finding someone who because like I did find someone they were slightly cheaper but like the range is still the same as what Lawrence was charging me and so I'm just like okay so I just have to decide um, to stay with this for a while because I want to take care of other things first before I get to the door I just didn't like the way it looked 
So now, I'm seated over here and I'm thinking. And then I was like, wait, the doors we removed yesterday in the closet, that closet here. I was like, what if they fit? What if they're like the right size? Because I was like, because if that means I can just open them in the morning and then we have light coming in and then just close them in the evening and it's all dark. I'm okay with that. Like, I'm chill. That's okay, right? So I went and pimmed them. They're small. And then I was just over there like, oh, man. And then just next to that door is where the original doors of the house used to be. That's where they are, the, the original doors of this house. I just sit there. And then I was like, wait, please, can, can this be the right size? So I pima and it's off by like two centimeters. Two, which two centimeters is nothing because that can be filled in with a lot. Two centimeters. And I was just like, Ex how had I not thought of this? Because I've had this doors this entire time. And I went and even bought a whole whatever. Because I'm like, in length, I just pim at like the height. And for me, I was just like, just make sure it's below the glass. Just make sure it's below the glass. Please let it be below the glass. It is, it gives me like the perfect amount below the glass to cut. Like I can go in with my, like I can, I can just put this on top of my work table with my circular saw, just one slice. And I have a freaking window. And now, not only is it like, oh, we can open it for light. Even when we close it, glass, we have lights. As in, how, how did, how is it that this just occurred to me? I don't know. Yani this entire time, ninge kwa nadirisha inaleta mwangaza. Instead of this ugly contraption we put together. Mm hmm Instead of this like random bows from left, right, and center, let's meet somewhere in the middle type situation, I would be rocking an actual freaking window. And this place has like such beautiful lighting. I could be working there. This is like with my... Yeni? I, I am I'm shocked at myself. I'm shocked that this just occurred to me this entire time and when i had like fundis running around here it did not occur to me it's occurring to me on a sunday afternoon when i'm painting by myself with no assistant my sister was here for two days we were working with with her for two days it i because now i'm just over here i'm thinking what hmm okay i'm glad it has occurred to me as much as it's late it's still going to serve us because now the moment I noticed that I was like, now there's no pressure. There's no pressure for the door. Like that pressure, just cause like the way this thing looks is like, that's what was giving me pressure. There's no pressure. I can work at my own pace now. Like I can take care of things in the, the format that I had put down. <laughs> ah, wow. Like, this entire time. Hmm?
so we finally installed this window and the lighting in here is game changing of course we know this window has really good lighting but like after installing this particular spot it's really game changing it brought in so much light into the room i was not able to film as we installed or as i cut the doors to turn them into windows because it was raining outside and we were trying to really rush through it and we we're working with power tools and all that because it rained all afternoon yesterday so i was not able to film much outside and also the work that was continuing here but i did finish priming as you can tell my walls are nice and <laughs> my walls are nice and primed um and yeah i just wanted to come on here and bid you goodbye in a manner that actually makes sense <laughs> in a manner full manner um and i wanted to thank you for watching this video I didn't really get to see much of what i had promised we are yet to finish the cabinets because but we finished the base the only thing that's left with the base um the any the only thing left to be done with the base are the doors and then we are going to do the top cabinets but a lot was happening at the same time the good thing is we've primed almost all the walls so that is major major progress um and our window there's so much good lighting as in the fact that i had not thought of that is just insane you know do not forget to check out the link in the description box for a chance to get a free trial of skillshare i will see you in the next video have yourself a lovely lovely weekend bye